<clears throat> hey guys, Hat Guru coming at you today with another book review. This is going to be my last book review for a while. Um, so anyway, let's get into it. Uh, today I'm going to be reviewing the Web Application Hacker's Handbook, 2nd edition by David Studdard and Marcus Pinto. So, this book is very dense. Um, I got this book for like $20 on Amazon and the reason it's so cheap is because it's pretty old. Um, it was published in 2011, and the reason it's still relevant is because <clears throat> a lot of things in um, web application security haven't changed much. Yeah, there have been some changes, and this book does have outdated parts, but if you're doing something like bug bounties, I would definitely recommend this book. So there's a, almost 900 pages in here. Um, as you can see, I have a lot of folded pages like in my other videos. Um, and it just it walks you through like every possible bug in uh, web application software. So, um, like tokens is a big thing that's really prevalent in here. Um, predictable tokens. It teaches you a little bit about the burp suite. Um, and one of the outdated parts is at the end of at the end of chapters. Um, there is like a quiz on the chapter and uh, that the answers to the quiz were actually on this website but um, the website's actually changed just to Burp Suite Academy so it used to have answers but now if you go to the website it just redirects to uh, Burp Suite um, where you can try the labs in there and uh, this book does a really good job of getting you prepared for that so right now I'm here near the end of the book. I think this is probably the, the most useful part um, because there's a step-by-step -step guide um, to methodology of bug bounty hunting. Like it takes all the content in the book and it organizes it for you in a step-by-step -step guide near the end of the book um, so that you, you, you're not lost and you just know. It's like a review on the whole thing. So it teaches a lot like fuzzing web applications, um, different types of bugs, um, certain, it'll familiar, familiarize you with certain softwares that are, um, I look, there's a picture of someone getting rickrolled. <laughs> um, it'll familiarize you with, uh, common bugs, like the same origin policy vulnerabilities, um, session hijacking I mean pretty much everything that's that's why this book is so good because it just it has everything you need um, I actually read this cover to cover but I'll be honest with you it was pretty hard uh, to read this like that um, because it, it can be very dry at times um, LDAP injection but yeah like I said it can be very dry um, one, one thing I would recommend is if you don't feel like reading the book just and you're doing bug bounties, just get it and then you can you can look up different types of vulnerabilities in here, token hijacking, um, time attacks, uh, session mechanisms. And I think this, this book was actually published way before bug bounties were a thing. And it's kind of funny because as you go through it, it you'd think it was written for someone that, that is doing bug bounties so um, yeah another thing it uh, has some tools in it but it often represents like here's an example of the quiz at the end of the book at the end of a chapter but um, yeah so all the all the labs on burp suite are pretty much dedicated to this book like there's a for every different kind of vulnerability in here there's a lab on it on, on uh, the burp suite academy so here's burp suite um, this book was actually written by one of the creators of Burp Suite, too. Um, mapping the attack surface, like, yeah, I could just go on and on. There's, there's literally so much, uh, content in here. I mean, it has a whole lot of stuff. Um, one example of something that's not in here, though, would be, um, API hacking. I think there's a couple pages on API hacking in here. Um, but, um, yeah, so persistent cookies, local privacy attacks, like, the book just goes on and on and on and on about attacks, like, every few pages is a different kind of attack, um, 
testing for XSS in uploaded file types, um, sanitization of input, um, varieties of XSS, yeah, so. Anyway, guys, uh, that's my book review for today on the Web Application Hackers Handbook 2nd Edition. Um, please like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll be dropping some normal content in the uh, near future, probably going back to uh, doing some tool videos on uh, Black Arts tools. And uh, I also wanted to make a video of how to install Black Arts or how to install Arch Linux. So, anyway, that's all, guys. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next video. All right, bye bye.